Danny, what is the project here? All right, so today what we're gonna do is we're gonna replace the gimbal bearing on this uh, on this vessel. So Can you repeat the gimbal bearing? The gimbal bearing, okay, is basically what aligns the the the, the, the yoke. It aligns this to the coupler, and that way when the drive turns, it stays straight. Oh, what is the symptom when a, a when you feel that uh, this uh, bearing is uh, damaged? Usually, when this, this is, when you get the when you get the sound, the rumbling sound when you turn hard to one direction. Ah, uh, okay. There's a couple of scenarios. If this is really frozen, it acts like a locked up motor. Okay. But all, mainly, it happens is when you're turning the engine, it gets really rumbling and really noisy sound. Okay. What happens if you continue using the boat? in that condition uh, what uh, what you damage more more elements yeah the worst case scenario if you're running and all of a sudden this jams you're gonna snap probably the, 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 the yoke the, i mean not the yoke the, 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 the u-joints or you cause damage to the housing itself okay and now we are going to start the process to remove that unit the drive unit what is the, the procedure step by step first thing we're going to do is we're going to take these off okay take, take this off on both sides if we can pull the shaft out, great. If we can't, then we have to take, loosen them off and we get that out. Okay. And then once we have that, then we got six six uh, studs with the uh, nuts that we gotta get out. All right, go ahead, guys. All right. So you're gonna need five eggs, okay? Separate both ends of the actuator. Hold this. And now the pin is free. And now you can remove the pin. Put all this in there. All okay. right. So let me let me explain some real quick. The reason I took that off is because I need to break the seal on here. Which one? The seal that goes from the from the drive to the bell house. Ah, okay, sure. Okay. So you got everything loose and that now now you see why I loosened this up because I figured this just never really comes out, but I was hoping that it did. So now we can maneuver. So now we're gonna loosen these and then hit it with a gun. What it looks like. Right. What you have to do. You're gonna need a small flat instrument. Just break it free, don't take them off. Break them free. And then we'll use the gun. That's it, that's good. Go to the next one. So if you look real quick here, you can see the salt buildup. See the salt buildup? So this is gonna be fun to get out. But the way I'm gonna do it, it's gonna come out. So listen, I go up like this. I need you oh, yeah. to kind of put it in here, okay? Which part, this, this side? Right First, here? let me just drop it. There we go. There it is, yeah. there it is. that's it, that's it. Yeah. Okay, let me stop. Wow. Take that out real quick. Okay, you, need, right. you need to remove yeah, I'll have to pull this a little bit more. Okay, look. Uh, look, look at this at the, cable. At the, at the oil, the oil um, uh, controller. Look at this. And there's a cable in there. And right. the cable for the throttle. I still need to go out a little bit more because it's clipped. Aye, 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 aye. All right. You need a little, see how it pops up? That cable right there. there. See how it just popped out? Yeah. Put the light, Papa. That cable right there. You see the salt buildup, look at all that salt. It's salt and grease, okay? So now I'm gonna pull it all the way out. You got it? Let's move it that way. Holy shit. Come on the light, Papa. Yeah, let me see that flashlight. This is why your gimbal bearing shot. Oh yeah. All right, but it has water in it. Yeah. All right. Because we have everything but grease. <laughs> Actually, the gimbal bearing doesn't feel that bad. But it's not bad. That's more grease than anything else. Actually, you should be good. That's a lot of grease. So here's your bellows. You can see your bellows. Actually, you know what? You don't have any problems with this. It looked like water here, but it's all grease. Uh, Danny, uh, what, what is the function of that tool? Please? Okay, the function of this tool here. Take this out of the bag. The pull down. Yeah. If you look at it, this is to go in, and then it went, pushes out. Comes like this and use the slide hammer. Now this is my homemade made slide hammer. I took it to a machine shop. It's a 10 pound hammer. There's the one that school has, you'll never get it out. So the whole idea is you line this up. It goes in, 
and catches like that. Yeah. Perfectly even. Mm -hmm. So you want to do the honors? I'm knocking it out. Yeah. So My listen, best. the only thing I'm going to tell you is if you get your it's that caught here, uh -huh. it's oh, yeah. going to hurt. Okay? So yeah, be conscious of it. So this is what you're going to do. <laughs> you're going to go in, get that lined up as possible, and then just slightly so you can put a little pressure against it. Okay? Mm -hmm. Right now you got to bring it back because it's not going to get in there. Try it. If you can, I'll do it. But I just want you to see if you try it. Get that, bro. Step out. That's a pretty, that's a pretty snappy high wrench you got there. <laughs> that thing will pull in. Well, it's just behind the <laughs> big wrap. I don't know actually. How far? So just behind the. Uh, yeah, let, let me just show behind you. here, right? Yeah. Just no, the, pass over well, there. Pass over there him completely. Him noise when turn, turn pass over there. So, pass, pass, pass. Enter, enter. More, 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 so more. Like more. Oh, correct. And now pull, 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 pull and you feel. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay so let's That's perfect. And now with the knot tight a little. So you're gonna want to get at an angle from the side. Are you lefty or righty? Righty. So you're gonna use your right hand to slide that hammer back. And. Ah, that one you pulled the seal and everything. So that one was that, supposed that, to stay in. That one was yeah. supposed to stay in. Put it on the floor on that on that cloth. On the cloth. On the cloth. Okay, so let's go. Let's talk you rem you remove the the watcher of the anchor in front. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now you have that clean. So kind of with your fingers in the middle, kind of place it. Like oh, I need a small hammer. Give me a small hammer. Some Can I use your light, please? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Absolutely. Okay. All right. It's completely. We are going to clean better, and uh, we are going to put the washer again, and after that the bearing. All right. Washer is ready. Yeah. Okay. Le, le dejo un poco de grasa dentro. No, no. Voy... Déjalo así. It's okay. Okay. Eh, que limpie más? O... Yeah, limpie más. The pressure comes from inside. Okay, out. but uh, with with your hands, with your fingers, you feel that uh, it is it's perfect. The circle, no? It's touching. It's okay. okay. Let me touch. Okay, and now start with the with the punch. In diagonal. In diagonal. In diagonal. In diagonal. In diagonal. You don't have a big socket in there somewhere? No, this is, no, this is okay. Is it flush against the, the aluminum? Oh, yeah. I mean, to make sure. Anyone want to feel it? Yeah, it's good. Okay, you, you hit that race, it'll, it'll turn it in, and you can pull it out, yeah. and the new one you can put it back in. Okay? okay. So we're going to do same same concept. So you, okay? you change Maybe the race, and you keep the, the light, cage? Light, 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 light. Kind of put it like you hey, have to hold it in place, okay? Hmm. Got some grease, maybe it'll come. Oh, so let me let me explain something to you. you know, <laughs> even the blind can see now. Oh my okay. god! Same concept. You tap, tap. Once you get it in there, Around and then you do the X pad. Yeah. Now in the bottom. Button. On the side. Side. Okay, so now, now you have it in there. Look, no, it's not in yet. No. You're gonna want to get a bigger hammer. You need a hammer for man. Yeah. Maybe use the back side of the hammer. Okay, well, Danny, uh, now we are going to align the system, no? Yeah, basically this is on the drive, like you see over here. The drive right there. Correct. So this is what it looks like with it out. This acts like it, so I can align this gimbal bearing with the coupler of the engine on the, on the, on the, uh, okay. on the flywheel, okay? All right. And uh, how is the procedure? So you're going to stick this in first. I just want to get it to line, and then I'll do the final adjustments. You're laying in here. There it goes. Just had to convince it.
Wow. I think your thing is out of alignment. I think it needs to go up. It's in the Let me see that flash there. Yeah, the motor's higher. Look, look inside. Look inside, Abel. The nose of the engine is down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so you're going to need a 1 and 1 16. We're going to align this. This is why I can't get it in. So you see, that's probably why you're hearing that noise. The front of the because motor the is down. The alignment is putting too much pressure on one side of the bearing. OK. That explains why that bearing is not bad, but you have pressure. But look, if you look at it, look down the center, you can see that the motor, the front of the top of the motor has to go down. You see it? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's clear. Yeah, yeah. It's clear. The front is down. Yeah. So now you need a one in one sixteen socket. Remember how we did the motor mounts over there? So grab your grab your grab your wrenches. You're lucky. There's a lot of room in his engine compartment. So I put grease. Remember I told you put grease on the uh, on the alignment tool to yeah. know where you're at. Look, see the spline marks? Oh yeah. Look where it's touching. I should have that spline mark evenly all the way around. Evenly all around. So you're almost there. Keep going. Okay, so listen. Get the hammer. Tap it on the back side. No, 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 no. That's the other. Hit it hard. Hard, hard. Okay, so listen. Hard. So now. I want to just I just want you to see this real quick, okay? You don't have it all the way in, right? Yeah, no. So if you look, it's, it's too hot. Yeah. So then you go here, tap down. Oh. Now try to get it in. As, there you go. There you go. Keep going. There you go. There you go. Underneath. There you go. Okay, too much, but go ahead. Alright, tap it in. You there are you go, there you go. Look, now hit it hard. Danny, you are centering yep. the tool. All right, so now, now it's centered. Hit up here, down here, on the side, on the side. Now hit it again. Look how nice winning. Now twist it. Nice. Pull it out. Okay, hold on. So it might not, it might not be centered still. So you might have to hit. Someone push that wood. There you go. Here on the very edge of the wood. Here, move that wood. Yeah. All right, there we go. Oh, shit. Too much. Okay. All right, so look. So now turn the prop. Turn the prop. Oh, it's already lined. So there we go. All right. So now, what's nice is because this is so heavy, I do the same thing at the shop. Now, when you hit this, don't hit here because you'll break it. Okay. Mm -hmm. See, I have tool that helps because I used to do this this way all the time, but I'm 
As you get older, it gets harder. So now I just do this, watch. All right, so our first things first. These are not aligned. No, I know. So look. Mm -hmm. Here, no, put the line and twist it out a little bit. There you go, there you go. Okay, a little bit more. Sure. Yeah, a little bit more. Hold it right there. Hold, no, no, can leave it there. A little bit more. Yeah, we're gonna leave it there? Up, up, up. Leave it, leave it. A little bit, right there, hold it right there. Side, check, no. uh, check the bottom. Check the, the bottom stuff. Down the other side. Sure. All right, use the check use the, the pry bar. <laughs> there you go. There you go. See? You gotta have a touch. I have to wiggle. Okay. Now look. Come on this side. All of you come on this side with a flashlight so you can see. And I'll stay on this side. Now you see in here. See the cable? Yeah. See the cable? Yeah. It's almost lined up, right? I gotta go in a little bit and push that top tab. With the needle. Hand me that screwdriver so I can just show. The top tab, I gotta push down once that cable goes through. One thing. Just tell me when it moves in a little bit. More, no, it's not entering. You need to move. There he goes. All right. So it's in. Let me tighten my thing. Okay. All right, now look at it. It's closed. Look at it. Yeah. See? It's closed. Yeah. Now I'm ready to go in. Yeah. Put your nuts on. That's it. Bingo. Mm. And uh, put the equators on yeah, the pin. First put, put the, and the first rubber six, and the rubber uh, um Correct. Yeah. Right. And bingo finito. The unit is ready. Right.